Hey everybody, I'm Michael, and this is a video walkthrough for Silent Footsteps. This is a Swedish mystery adventure game. It's sort of similar to the Carol Reed series. It's about a detective named Rebecca. She's investigating the, the death of her good friend, Nikki. And she'll be going through a bunch of very cool screens like this. I really like the backgrounds and such. They're very stylized. My name is Rebecca. Hi, Rebecca. Nice to meet you. When I was younger, Nikki and I were best friends. She died recently, and I was in the will. I got the keys to her apartment and a short note. It's said to follow in her footsteps. So that's what I will do. And that's the mystery. What happened to Rebecca? Let's see what we can find. Yeah, what can we find here in her apartment? Let's see. To access the menu, you, you right-click, basically. Okay, okay, cool. Let's take a look inside here. What is that? Some sort Looks of Looks almost map. like it belongs on a map. Yeah, it's just, that's just what I was saying. Okay, it's a map thingy. We'll save that for later. Anything else I can pick up here? Uh, I, don't, I don't see anything. Alrighty. So this is the kitchen. It is a total mess. <laughs> very, very messy. Uh, this looks like a puzzle. Yeah, that's definitely a puzzle. Definitely a puzzle. Alright. And we have some noodles. Mm, yummy. Delicious. Alright, I don't see anything here. Have some baked beans, marshmallows. Yeah, yeah, I really like the the, the artwork. It's kind of cool. I, I'm pretty sure they took like real life photos and then ran them through a filter. But uh, it, 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 they're pretty cool looking. I, I, I think it's nice. It's the fridge. Nothing, nothing very interesting in the fridge. I see. Else. I could have sworn there was another room. Here we go. Okay, so to the side we have a bathroom. And we have a bedroom. Inside the bedroom we have this. We need to find a way to open it. So we're going to get a can opener and open it later on in the game. Let's see, is there anything on the shelf that I can pick up? Seeing lights. Is this my book? Did I write this book? No. Well, we do have this clue. That that totally looks like a clue. And when he turned around, he froze. What was this thing he was looking at? It wasn't there before. With trembling steps, he walked towards it. Veronica looked at the ocean. So peaceful, so still. Interesting. Interesting. That is just an old box of bananas. We don't, we don't need bananas. Let's see. Uh, we have pills. An anti-anxiety drug. The side effects can be nasty. In short, she might have been confused. So Rebecca uh, might have been taking these drugs and might have been, like, hallucinating weird things. I don't know, maybe that's why she set up this kind of weird scavenger hunt for us. Oh, and here's a knife. She did set up a scavenger hunt for us, right? She left clues behind as to where she is and what was happening. I don't know. Let's change this music. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. I'm dancing. I'm dancing. Whoa! Oh, yeah. All right. Can I have this music the whole time? No, I guess I can't. Okay, fine. I'll, I'll listen to the mystery music then. Ooh, a key to the basement. Key to the basement, good to know. That is really old. A really old video game. Wow. Wow. Cool. Oh, and this is kind of interesting. I thought that we would have a puzzle with invisible ink in this game. 
but I don't think we do. I don't. I don't think we do. It, it's interesting. We we see how to make invisible ink, but I don't think we ever will make invisible ink in this game. Kind of a strange decision, I suppose. And if you want to see a place that can be interacted with, uh, just click the space bar. Sort of looking like this. So it says, hey, you go up here. And, you know, that can be used to help you find something that you've missed. Well, here on the map, we only have two locations. Uh, Nikki's home and the basement. So let's check out this basement. First, we have this door, which we're going to open. Giving me uh, another set of keys. Okay. So I think this might be the key, right? The key opens up this basement thing, this basement thing. So we have a safe. I do not know the code to the safe yet, so I can't open it. Looks like I also have a symbol. I think I know where that is. It's a, it's a location. So we'll go there. We'll go there. We will definitely go there. Let's see. Is there anywhere else we can go to? Hmm. I don't know. I think I, I got myself a little turned around. Okay, I got that door. Because I know there should be somewhere at... Okay, let's exit. Go back into the basement. There should be somewhere at the end of the hallway. Here we go, the laundry room. Alright, do we have any laundry? No, but we have a pen. We definitely need a pen. That's that's important. Let's see, I do want to take a look at my wallet right here. I'm going to open it up. I have my bank code number. I should hide this already. I shouldn't be carrying it with me. Ah, oh my. Okay, so now we're going to leave the basement. Check out this lay-by area. Where are we? This is... Huh. Well, let's sit down, I suppose. Ooh. Gonna take those. Yeah, those look useful. And let's sit down. Wait a minute. From this perspective, I think I see something. What is it? The shelter. Definitely. Yeah, so this is definitely starting to look like a scavenger hunt. My friend definitely set up a fancy scavenger hunt for me to find in case she died. And well, she did die, so now I'm solving the scavenger hunt mystery. Let's see, we want to take a look here. What do we have to pick up? Okay. Okay, it's a horseshoe. That's weird. Um, yeah, that's a weird clue. Nothing here. Aha! Ah, that's, that's, that's like a potato. That's like a potato character. Uh, yeah, wow. Uh, this is a cool picture, though. I think this could be like a background for a computer. That would be awesome. Okay, so let's see. What, what, where am I going? Have I missed a clue somewhere? Well, if you ever feel like you're lost or you've missed a clue, you have a good friend in this game, the Hint Notebook. It says, I forgot to check the hidden... Uh, I forgot to check the kitchen cupboard. Oh, no! Oh, no! Okay, now how do I get out of here? Hmm. Exit. Well, there we go. So, Nikki's kitchen cupboard. I could have sworn I checked that, but maybe I missed something there. I did. Okay, you're supposed to look at the can of beans. Inside is a note that reads, Robin, who lives at Cooper Street, 22. So, in the next video, we'll go to Cooper Street and talk to Robin. I believe this Robin woman has a clue for us. Robin will tell us something which will let us proceed with the scavenger hunt.